Welcome back everybody, I'm Lars, this is Hearts of Iron 4 as the Dijk and we are now getting ready here to attack Yugoslavia which ended up in a faction with France. This is uh, this is crazy. Hmm. Almost all their victory points. Oh, we can actually grab quite a few. All right. We need to start moving our planes down here. You get down here. You get down here. And yeah, we'll just move all of you guys down here. That should be enough to keep us going for quite a while. Uh, the two of you will just go to, I guess, we have some down here, we'll put some, yeah, in the Rhineland here. That should be good as well. Yeah, we have the pact. That's good. Now, we don't want an alliance with the USSR. That's um, but I think should we now try to grab these guys? I should have done this way earlier. Yeah, we'll just keep going down here. We'll do this war without thinking too much about Poland. We'll, we'll, Poland will get theirs. That's the thing. Um, still have some air support up here. It looks like Moscow signs the pact. Our new Bolshevik friends. Rhineland, Lower Austria. Okay, yeah, they haven't... Right. France bans communism. Holy crap. What does that even mean? So they had like a decent amount of communism, but now... No, go with Britain. Oh crap. Because this is... front. Hmm... Is this because uh, they want to join the allies? Damn it! What about you? You are still not fascist. We're getting there. How about little Belgium? You aren't really getting that much more fascist. What if we stage a coup? Hmm. That will take a long time. Oh, and they have to... Yeah, I don't want that to happen way, way, way down in Africa. Huh. I guess that plan won't work. We'll end up uh, in the war anyway, it seems. Maybe an alliance with... No, I don't want to do that. They're stinky. Stinky Russians, you know? Well, sounds a bit harsh, I guess. <sighs> I guess this is it. We'll just have to do this. Do we... Do we have anyone in the Axis at all? No. This should get these guys in there, I'm pretty sure. Hmm. I think I messed up this thing here because I, don't, I just don't have the troops I need. We'll just have to start deploying things early just to get more feet on the ground really just more boots come with your stumping boots and let's make this happen answers we'll just uh, these guys are trained enough I guess we'll just 
take them. You guys go down to this front. Oh, that's a bit much, isn't it? We don't want to go over here, I guess. We'll put you on the French front, just with some mountaineers and these panzers and stuff. Need some more training. These guys are close enough. Well, no, damn it! Well, actually, I guess we'll just do this instead then. This. And you are all supposed to go here. You are all supposed to go through with this one. 24. Three divisions will push through here. 14 will go here. Yeah, so they sort of divide up a bit at some point here. But that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. I think... Everyone should go here, and I want to send just some SS divisions and some tanks on this one. Yeah. Battle plan is good. Uh, he, yeah, plan is considered to be at our uh, to our advantage. Frog squashers, you think everything is risky? You pansy. I would like to, well, we'll keep this front, basically, we'll stay here, just keep them back, and I'm going to move you guys over here, just to keep Western Germany safe-ish. Somebody still doesn't have their orders. And that would be the Polish front, which is basically not able to keep this going, but that's fine. I just want these guys to get done so I can ship them down to the French front, and then I think we will... Uh, when these guys level up, yeah, in a couple of days, we will uh, just stop training and take this... Uh, camp thingy and just move almost everything down here. Just keep a couple of guys so we have a deployment point. Um, let's see. Come on. Oh. Okay, so... Okay, we don't want to train these guys. We will just keep that one guy and the tanks there. You will go down to this front, which is basically a defensive front. We will slow the game down quite a bit, and... Oh, research as well. Oh, lots of research stuff. Could do weapons too early, but again, I don't think it's that useful. For right now, at least. Mm, artillery. Again, something we might want to do. Yeah. I think we'll try. Because we did outfit a lot of our troops with that stuff. Mm. Yeah, and we will do some uh, more research there as well. And there are some guys that are... Unable to move to a province along its path. But you should all be here. Just. Yeah. Contagious. You are. Yeah, the fortified thingy. That, and that's fine. And some divisions are not in positions. We'll wait on that, I guess. I'm just gonna do like so, just to get everything into position, and we should be able to uh, start this war, finally. 
<laughs> it's about damn time, right? It's time for war. Yeah, so we have one more Panzer thingy here. Panzer. Yeah, you're close enough. Stop training, just go towards the front. Seriously. Now we have 95. It's not enough, but we are still training more guys. Deploy you and get you trained up. And this just takes time, so that's fine. Equipment. Yeah, the problem here is actually art artillery. <sighs> yeah, we need a lot of that stuff. And we need more infantry stuff. We need a lot of things. I feel less confident than I would wish to feel at this point, but at this point I think we'll have to go for it. We'll have to start capturing more industrial um, capacity instead of trying to just, yeah. <sighs> Let's go all Leroy Jenkins on this thing. You're still preparing. Yeah, but you are not going to do anything. That's the thing. You are going to. <sighs> uh, we don't have any allies, but we might as well. And conquer. And we have air wings with no mission. That would be those guys. They are going to go down to the Alpine region until mm hmm yeah. Until further notice really. Just you should all be here as well. It's good, and we are at war. France hasn't joined yet but they will yeah so we are at war with France beautiful beautiful now Italy would you like to join the faction no <laughs> we have a war that they may be drawn into but they do like that we really don't like the French Send volunteers request from Italy. Yeah, sure. Why don't we do that? And I will activate that because it seems to be advantageous. I'm going to let th the general actually do this because even though it would be perhaps f it might be faster just to attack myself. It's... I don't know. Just... Feels bad, man. <laughs> Volunteer forces, that's fine. Yeah, so they are potentially stronger than us. In theory, but we are s so tanked up, it's crazy. I'm going to deploy these lines as well. Just get them out there. And we will do somewhat fewer of these, I think. Because we don't have the industrial capacity right now. So we will stop the production where we don't have anything. And you guys will just finish up that stuff. And you guys are missing support equipment. That's the major thing right now. Mm. Okay, infantry need is now filled. We'll go down a bit to get the support equipment filled and yeah need a bunch more tactical bombers and stuff uh, this is fine it's okay we need tungsten fine Portugal didn't you have some of that stuff thank you thank you kindly right. 
let's increase the speed back up a tiny bit and see. Ah, oh, France and Britain announce alliance. Don't you dare call in Britain into this shit. I'm going to get really, really annoyed. Okay, so we did push there. That's good. Don't call them in. They're not part of the alliance, so you can't call them in. Please, please don't. <laughs> it would be bad. Right. Is there anything we need here? Infantry division attack. Yeah, logistics. Just getting less attrition would be good. Uh, hmm. I think... Division recovery rate. I think just attack. We're going to crush them all. So, they won't actually attack us here. Which is good. And we won't really do anything just yet. What we could do though is some strategic bombing. Bases in low supply. Bases to oh. Whatever. I don't care. Yes. No supplies. It's fine. That's because you're dummies. So do we have a lot of bombers over here now? Is that the thing? Yeah, tactical bombers. Tactical bombers. You guys should move over to... Uh, I guess... Over here. Yay! And now I would really like some of you guys to start hitting France. That so basically all of you guys I'm going to start now hitting France instead. Uh, we will do close air support, all that stuff, yes, but we will also do strategic bombing. If we can get the air superiority over uh, them, then two of you will also start hitting France. And do some strategic bombing. Do we have any more planes just spread around here? Well, we did remove everything from the Eastern Front. Okay. Well, uh, we just have to hope that this works. Uh, how's our uh, Northern France thingy here? Do we have a superiority? Uh, holy crap, we need more fighters over here. Like a couple of hundred at least. I know this isn't our main base, but s damn, still. Uh, Northern France. Uh, mission efficiency is not good, and that's because you're there. I think I. Yeah, I think I need you to be. Maybe over here instead. Maybe that helps. You are good though, you are really efficient at bombing basically everything. Oh, and you should retreat if you need to. Uh, tactical bombers, you will only go during the night. At least the ones that do like strategic bombing. You will only go at night, that's a hundred of you. You guys will go night and day, but you won't do strategic bombing. We don't want to do too much of that stuff. I think... Yeah. We don't have any radar, do we? Like, at all. I never built that stuff. 
or anti-air. Crap! We, we really need that stuff. Holy crap. Yes. Uh, <laughs> I knew I forgot something, right? Slovenia is sort of messed up. That's fine. We will just go... These things are actually more important right now than anything else. So if I reduce this and push it way up, then it should finish up pretty quickly, giving us more construction speed. All right. You are doing well. That's good. We have another panzer thingy here that can join up. That's great. I think we're doing fine down here, though. This is good. We do have another airbase now. Uh, Slovenia, it takes quite a few planes here. So we can just move these guys and then... Yeah, you guys should now do your stuff in the Western Balkans instead. Yeah, we can't cover the area, that's fine though. And um, we're still going to do your thing. That should help us fight through this thing. And we should be able to mop this up and then go uh, deal with the damn um, French. Are they actually attacking here? Yeah, they're trying to attack my line. No, or maybe that was the stupid Italians trying to attack. We don't want to attack France. We just want to bleed them dry. Slowly but surely. We have lost a bunch of people. Yugoslavia has lost more. That's the important thing. And our production now. We do need more of these guys. We do have close air support. We have enough of. That's the thing. I think I'm just going to almost stop producing that stuff. And this is probably good here. Do need a lot of tanks to do reinforcement and all that stuff, but we aren't going to uh, make that many of them anymore, so that's fine. We'll just we'll, we'll just do this, we'll try this, and if it doesn't work, we'll try something else. Can't be that hard, right? <laughs> well, I guess we'll see in the next episode. I'll see you then.